If you need to edit or upload or delete multiple files at once from your server, the easiest way to do that is through SFTP. To get started, you'll need to download an FTP client like FileZilla. You can click this link right here to be taken directly to the download page. Once it's downloaded, you can open FileZilla and it should look something like this. Now keep in mind this video is being recorded on a Mac, but this process is exactly the same for Windows. Now we need to head over to our server panel to grab some information. To do that, we can head over to panel.simplegamehosting.com. Once you log in, you'll be presented with this page where you can select the server you want to manage. Click SFTP in the menu bar to be taken to a page with all of your details. Now the information on this page is blurred because it is specific to every server. So what is shown for me here is going to be different for you. First, what we need to do is copy the server address. We can do this by clicking the two boxes to the right. Now we need to open the site manager in FileZilla, which we can do by hitting the button in the top left corner. At this point, you can make a new folder or you can simply hit new site. What this is going to do is allow us to name our new site. So I'll just call this test server. Once it's named, we first need to change protocol from FTP to SFTP. Now we need to paste the server address that we copied before on the panel right into the host section. From here, we can leave logon type as normal. And now we need to go back to the panel to grab our username. Copy that with the two squares to the right and then come back to FileZilla and hit paste. Now your password is going to be the password that you use to log into the panel. Keep in mind, this is the password for the panel, not the billing section. So if you used different passwords when setting up the panel and the billing area, you will need to use the one that you set for the panel. Once all of that information is in, you can go ahead and hit OK or connect. If you ever want to connect again, open your site manager and just hit connect. It's also worth noting that you will most likely be prompted to trust the connection. When you do this, you will log into the server via SFTP. But once that's done, you should see all of the information over in the right side of the screen. It's worth noting that everything here over on the left side is what's local to you. For instance, that would be your desktop, your documents folder, your home folder, and stuff like that. On the right side is the site or server that you are connected to. Here we should see all of the same information that we could see on our panel in the file manager. You can drag and drop files from your computer to your server or vice versa. For this example, I just added a basic screenshot for testing, but if we come back to our file manager, we should see the screenshot down here. If you want to delete something with SFTP, right click on it and just hit delete. And as always, if you ever have any questions, feel free to reach out to us on live chat in the bottom corner of the screen.